Uh, I've been putting OVCs on teeth for around two and a half years. Uh, and we've done, I, I stopped counting at about 300, but I think we must have done between five and 600 procedures. In one visit, place a permanent restoration uh, and provide the patients with a, a quick, efficient way of, of solving their problems. The types of cases where I mainly use the OVCs are uh, after endodontics to place a permanent restoration to protect the tooth immediately after placing my filling. This is quite good in that if I do need to re-access, I can drill straight through the OVC in case of need for further work. The other time I find the OVC is quite effective is in replacing the uh, baby boomer type great big amalgams. Often these teeth have multiple cuspal fractures and the fact that I can clean off all of the fractured cusps and the amalgam and then place a permanent restoration in one visit is very valuable. The procedure, particularly on a sensitive tooth, often results in immediate relief of symptoms. Uh, and once again, if you do have a problem, you can drill through the OVC and perform a root canal without destroying your restoration. When my patients present needing some sort of cuspal coverage restorations, I usually give them three options based on price. They can have a large complex composite, an OVC or some sort of ceramic, either zirconia or Emax. I find offering them three options is quite useful as the majority of people will look at the three options and take the middle option. Hence, I've performed many OVCs. Many people still choose on price to take the composite, but I do have to advise them that while my composites are quite good, they will not give the aesthetic or the strength of an OVC. I found that my patient base has responded quite well to the OVCs. They like the fact that they can have their new tooth placed in one visit and obviously be half the price of an equivalent Emax crown. Uh, they have found it a more comfortable financial procedure. Uh, afterwards, I've had very few problems and, and most people have recommended friends to come and get the procedure done if they have needed a crown on one of their teeth. And several patients have had multiple OVCs placed. Yeah, on my recall, I have been quite impressed with the OVCs. I have sound, found they possibly collect slightly more stain than a full ceramic restoration, particularly around the margin. Uh, after polishing, they usually come up very nicely and with sufficient gloss, I have found they've been quite effective. One OVC is fractured on me out of about 500, uh, but this was due to secondary decay and was possibly uh, an overly ambitious tooth to try and restore. Otherwise, they seem to have sufficient strength. Only time will tell if they wear as well as hoped, but initial impressions are very good. When starting to perform OVCs, I have found many patient referrals they often send their friends and family who they know require crown type restorations placed as well. In this post amalgam era that we're in, with baby boomers, often with heavily filled posteriors, this is a very good option for people to replace their large old amalgams and repair their fractured cusps with a cosmetic and cost effective alternative.